I would like to sincerely thank the UTS alumni for founding and organizing these amazing awards, as it gives the opportunity for UTS graduates to show their colors and how much they have achieved thanks to the fantastic education that they received at UTS. All of us standing up here tonight have been chosen as we represent high achievers in our respective fields of endeavor. So we are living proof that UTS provides excellent training for launching careers. I have many fond memories of my time at UTS in the biomedical campus. It was the first time in my education that I truly felt at home. Studying subjects that absolutely fascinated me and being surrounded by fantastic lecturers and support staff. Indeed, it was a conversation in the corridor with Professor Kevin Brody that quite literally changed my life. He knew, I knew that my passion was in biomedical science, but I was not feeling fulfilled by the part-time job I held as a hospital scientist, and I wanted to do more than process patient specimens. Kev asked me, have I ever considered doing research? To which I replied, well, what's, what's research? To cut a long story short, I did summer vacation research studentship with him, and it totally got me hooked, and I've never looked back. The lab is like a home to me. I can't imagine doing anything else other than scientific research. Like all scientists, I love the challenge and the thrill of the discovery, and I'm extremely lucky to have a job that combines my hobby with something that's truly worthwhile. Going into the lab each day to try and identify genes and signaling pathways that are involved in cancer initiation, progression and metastasis, and ways in which we can try and inhibit or even prevent these processes with the hope that this knowledge in some way can enable the development of therapies that could make a real difference to patients in the clinic, that is nothing but a privilege. I'm incredibly fortunate to have met and worked with many brilliant scientists over my 20 years in research, and each and every one of them deserves to be standing next to me tonight, as great research only comes when people collaborate, bringing together different sets of skills and expertise and ways of approaching a problem. I would like to accept this award on behalf of all of them and all the other hardworking researchers out there, quietly working away in the lab, doing their part to fill in the pieces of the puzzle that is trying to understand the world we live in. Before I finish, I would just like to thank specifically some people, please. Thank you to Jackie Robson for being so very wonderful and for organizing this event with all her helpers. Thank you to Professor Byron Morris for nominating me for this award. And thank you to the UTS Alumni Advisory Board for their excellent decision. <laughs> I'm honestly very, very, very grateful. On a personal note, I would like to thank my husband and our two children for their continued love and support. As a fellow scientist, my husband and I spend many hours talking about boring work, much to the exasperation of our children, and his input has been invaluable to me. Finally, I would like to thank two people without whom I wouldn't be here for many, many reasons. My parents, my mum and my dad, are inspirational. They're the most hardworking, generous, loving and caring parents you could ever wish for, and they're the wind beneath my wings. Thank you very much.